Welcome back in. Great to have you along on WKYT. And if you like creepy, crawly creatures, you can see lots of them at the UK Arboretum. The Kentucky Children's Garden is holding an insect safari and is coming up this Friday. We're joined now by Molly Davis, UK Arboretum Director, along with Blake Newton from UK's Department of Entomology. We do thank you for coming in, and you have not come without some friends, too. <laughs> right. Uh, what do we have here? Uh, we a tarantula? Have, um, we have a tarantula. This is called a rose hair tarantula. She's going to be one of our guests on Friday evening and also during the day on Friday. And she's called Rosie. And wow. we usually don't let. Um, members of the public holder because you never know what she's going to do because she does have large teeth but she's a relatively um, not not very dangerous uh, spider. So the teeth might hurt you but you're yes. not going to you know fall over dead. Right? I hope not. No. <laughs> not the venom is not very powerful. Sure the teeth that. though are very big. They're as big. They're the same size and shape as a cat's claw. Mm, wow. Well, I hope mm -hmm. you uh, behave yourself a little yes. bit Blake. Uh, Molly <laughs> tell us about uh, what uh, kids and others can experience on Friday. Well Friday's kind of great because it's all about insects all day long whether they come to the children's garden from 10 to 1 for first Friday fun day or to the insect safari at the visitor center from 7 to 9 that night kids can get their fill of insects. Um, they can see giant cockroaches, they can see tarantulas, they can play games, they can see what else, more, more insects, butterflies, mm -hmm. moths, larvae, worms, <laughs> all kinds of stuff. It, Blake, the reaction that you get from kids, what's it like? It's usually it's usually um, <laughs> shock and awe. They, um, they, they, and it's, uh, we like them so much because it's a great way not just to teach about insects, but about nature in general, about science in general. So they're great sort of mascots or ambassadors for science education. Well, now that Rosie's in there, you have another friend. Yes, yes. and this one should be with us on Friday too. This is a tobacco hornworm. So this used to be a scourge of Kentucky. It would eat our tobacco uh, plants. Uh, kids would have to go out and, um, and pick tobacco worms. But today we don't see too many of these in the state anymore. But this turns into a big gray moth. Mm -hmm. What is it about kids and creepy crawly things? They really do, and it, it, it does get their attention, doesn't it? I think it does because there, there, there's a certain like yuck factor, uh -huh. but it's also sort of fascinating because they are they are creatures too. They matter just as much as your dog or your cat. Um, you might not want to keep that tarantula as a pet, <laughs> but um, but they're just fascinating for kids to learn about. And two events on Friday. Tell us the times. 10 to 1 for the morning in the children's garden, 7 to 9 for the insect safari at the visitor center. Oh, very good. Thank you very much for coming in. Thank Always you. a great time over at the Arboretum. We appreciate you being here. I'm glad you brought those friends in, too. Thank <laughs> oh, we'll you. leave them here. Are you sure that's okay? <laughs> yeah. Rosie You'll need them for the show Friday. Yeah. That's right. <laughs>